I feel like hospice is such an incredible gift to people when they need it most and to their families. It's really one of the most important community endeavors out there in our area or any area. It's kind of the last really um, act of humanity for, uh, for those that are suffering or dying. And uh, it just means a lot to the community, means a lot to the families that they uh, support. Rockbridge Area Hospice's mission um, is to give loving care for folks in the final stages of their life. And not just the individuals, but also their families. My wife passed away in 2003. And it was for me probably the most painful experience in my life. And I recognized how important hospice must be to other people. When a patient goes into hospice, it's not about dying. It's about quality of life for, for as long as they live. It's joy to know that you are giving them some type of comfort. Tony was diagnosed with ALS in September of 2011. By about January of 2013, we had to have people to come in to help him because he couldn't use his hands very well. Hospice has been a huge help to us because they come in and help with Tony's personal care several times a week. They help um, deal with prescriptions and some of the equipment that we need for Tony's condition. We're able to focus on everyday lives. We're able to um, enjoy our time with our children more. We're able to make our lives just a little bit more normal. By focusing on living life fully, rather than the illness, it allows the families and the patients to make every moment matter and to really increase the amount of time that they have to express their love for each other and just find those joyful moments and create those lasting memories which is really important. Volunteering with Rockbridge Area Hospice uh, brings a fulfillment that, that most people don't experience um, in any other aspect of life. One of the biggest things that I've learned so far is that hospice gives you a second chance at life. And it's made me appreciate and realize that, that life is short, um, but while we're here, we need to enjoy it and um, really spend time with the people that, that we love. Mom has bone marrow cancer, and uh, when the doctor suggested that hospice come in, I did not want it. I felt like I was, I was giving up on her and not giving her a chance to get better. And I cannot explain how wrong I was. Hospice has been here to help us and to help improve the, her quality of life and make it, our life easier. There are lots of need for comfort care, and uh, hospice affords that to many of our citizens. At Rockbridge Area Hospice, we provide services regardless of the ability to pay. So whether a patient has insurance, doesn't have insurance, has Medicare, Medicaid, we will provide quality care for them. And part of how we're able to do that is by the amazing support that we have from our community. We get donations, sponsorships, we apply for grants but we really, really focus on just providing great quality service to everybody. Without the support of the community, this hospice wouldn't exist. Hospice really rep represents community at its deepest levels. When you see what hospice does, and you can see the results of hospice, and you, and you read about hospice and, and uh, the uh, services that they provide, as well as the feeling that they provide, it's not hard to get behind. We are neighbors helping neighbors. I'm a neighbor helping a neighbor. I'm a neighbor helping a neighbor. I'm a neighbor. I'm a neighbor. I am a neighbor. Helping a neighbor. Helping a neighbor. Helping a neighbor. We are neighbors helping neighbors. We're your neighbor. We are your neighbors. We are your neighbors. We